So I'd like to start off this video about Eugenia Cooney by first of all stating that this information I'm about to tell you may or may not be accurate. I don't know how accurate or reputable a source this is. So this information may or may not be accurate, but this is what I've heard about Eugenia Cooney. So anyways, a little bit of history on her. Um, it's said that she lives with both her parents and her younger brother, Chip. It's said that, um, I guess apparently, Eugene, from, from what I gather, it sounds like Eugenia Cooney has said in some of her videos that her dad works a lot, that he's not around. Based on what I've heard, I've heard that um, he, in fact, only works part-time. And that he he's self he's home and he works from home, he works from the home. So, I've also heard that both Eugenia Cooney's parents, this is what I've heard again, it may or may not be accurate, is that both her parents are heavy drinkers, alcoholics. I also read somewhere that um, her mom, when when she gets into one of her drunken um, states, <clears throat> that she can be quite difficult to deal with and potentially intimidating to deal with as well, too. And that um, Eugenia Cooney kind of serves as like, she kind of serves as like a parent herself. Like it sounds to me like she might be the most <laughs> responsible one around that, around that household. That she's basically taken on the role of caregiver herself to take care of her parents. And that her younger brother is a very needy, dependent person. This is what I've heard. And that um, her younger brother depends a lot on the housemaid. It's said that this information comes from the housemaid again. That's, that's what I heard. And it just sounds to me like Eugenia is in a very difficult situation there. I did, however, hear some good news. I did hear that Eugenia Cooney might be getting some outpatient help, might be getting some outpatient help for her eating disorder. But I guess in her situation, she, since she has her YouTube channel as well as her You Now uh, channel, I guess she doesn't want to take too much what I've heard, or what I speculate, is that maybe she doesn't want to take too much time away from that. And my speculation, based on that information I've heard from her, like some people might be thinking to themselves, well, you know what, she's in her 20s, why doesn't she just move out? <clears throat> and I guess my speculation on that is that she wants to stay there for her family, to try and take care of her family as best as she can. So that's what I'm guessing would be the reason why she won't move out. That is good news. If Eugenia Cooney is going to finally get some help for her, her eating disorder, that is good news. All we can do at this point in time is show our support. Show our support and love for her and offer her, you know, kind words and kind support and let her know that we're behind her that we want to see her get the support that she need get the the help that she needs because we want her to stick around for a long time because let's face it if she continues going in her current state she's not going to be here for long so that is good news that she might be getting outpatient support or might be about to get outpatient support. Let's let's hope that's the case.